comes out of the feet of Spellacid. Really well to pick that up, Aiden Spellacid. Nice pass over to the wing. Shot comes in, blocked away by Weninger. As Coventry plays have their first look, or first real look of the night. Two minutes and a little bit of change having gone. A little bump comes in from Carter Allen as Corneal look to try and drive towards the net front. Coventry have taken that puck away and are going to come up ice three on two, led by David Clements. Here's Mitch Cook, throws it to Clements. Clements drops it out in front of Spellacy. Got a piece of it. So did Zach Phillips, former first round pick. Have to try and find another avenue to the net. Here's McNulty. Back to Norwich. Gets a little bit of space at the top of the slot. Oh, he's thrown it front to the tip from Roth. Gloved down by Wedding of Coventry. All of a sudden at a 2-1-0 down low. Roth tried to get the redirection. Let's have a look at this one again. He might have been able to square it if he'd have had the, uh, I don't know, the communication, the vision. Probably more of a sixth sense than anything else. But big opportunity here for the Coventry Blaze. And that's a good save by Wedding As Luciani will... Grab that puck down in the neutral zone, brings it into the offensive zone. Has Mitch Cook in front of net, goes to throw it around the boards for Dudek. Now Thompson, back for J.D. Dudek to the goal line. Luciani to the half wall, Blaze looking down for the weak side. The saucer pass comes off the stick of Talberg. Storm are going to rush us on a two-on-one here. They've got Critchlow heading to the net from the puck area off the bar from Tyler Hinnom. And now J.D. Dudek's going to come the other way. Drops it off for Cook. Cook's got a shooting lane. Good blocker save by Wenninger. Luciani will pick this puck up. End to end stuff. 12 to go in the first. Cook comes in, sticked aside by Wenninger. Nice routine stick save from him. Great rebound control to kind of get that one out of any kind of danger. Here's Christo. Carries it across the line. Pulls up at the top. One timer down low by Kukali, just wide. Loose puck picked up by Blake Thompson. He throws it into the corner. McNulty comes back to cover as Manchester will play that puck up ice. McNulty straight back up north for Coventry with Roth heading towards the net. Shot comes in down low. Oh, he got a big redirection into the side netting. And the Manchester Storm will come away with it. It's Farley will chip that one in. Dallas Earhart's going to get there first. Spins away from the board, drops it in front and they score! Phillips saw that puck come all the way through to him. They added enough space to snap a quick one down low on the blocker side of Cozen. Gets his 10th goal of the season and the Storm are on the board first. Yeah, they cycled that puck round and just all the way through to Phillips. Doesn't get picked off there as it cuts through the two Coventry Blaze defensemen on that play. A weak pass across from Kukali. One of the shorts of Cook at the Garcia who goes and picks it up back in his own zone. And Storm come the other way. Chipped in behind Cozen, comes off the backboard down in front. And eventually to JD Dudek. Dudek to Hopkins. Hopkins throws it to Clements. Clements pulls it in, he shoots, redirected over the top via Zach Sullivan into the netting and we'll have a stoppage. Just nice bit of transitional hockey by the Blaze with a good block from Sullivan. As Kukali bustles through his man, it will allow Luciani to come up by. So Luciani gets around Morrow, thinks about throwing one out in front, ends up having to put the brakes on. Talberg arriving, he gets checked into the corner. Good keep alive by the defenseman. Curran out in front, looking for Luciani, he got poked checked by Morrow. Kukali's going to shoot, they tip and oh, that came off the top of the bar, I think. As the Coventry Blaze again, it's Luciani in front with the tippy. Scored a couple of those kind of goals against the Steelers last weekend as part of his hat trick. Kobe Roth had a good look earlier in the night with a tip that was gloved down, and that was agonizingly close. We just don't. Hinnom is going to enter the zone, drops it off to the wing, sent back out in front. Spellacy comfortably gets that one, and he'll send it the length. Earhart and Luciani will chase. Oh, Luciani's going to win this puck. Out in front, Blaze, short handed. Good save, Evan Winninger. A real beauty as Aiden Spellacy looks sure to tie it. What is it with these two teams and short-handed opportunities tonight? Face-off one by the Manchester Storm. Shots on goal and face-offs are pretty much on a knife edge between these two teams as Garcia is going to bring it across the line. Good pad save by Cozum. The rebound is hacked to the general vicinity of the uh, net as Hinnom's going to crash the net front here. Couldn't get a shot away. Now the Blazers are going to pick it up. Thompson. And try and charge up ice himself here. Always Tyler Hinnom and Taron Cozen have got all broken up behind the play. 
Down comes Brady Norris as, uh, well, he's not too happy. I'm not entirely sure as I was looking up ice where the puck was. Johnny Curran's going to have a little pop at Hinnom as well. Taron Cozen um, had Tyler Hinnom stick right by uh, right by his feet. Uh, Hinnom was going towards it, and Cozen obviously wasn't moving exactly out of his way. But then uh, Hinnom decided to rugby tackle uh, Tyron Cozen into the back of the net. Bryce with a check into the half wall. The Blazers are going to try and come away with it here. They might get an old-man rush. Talbot has Shearer exploding up ice. Shearer, what a save, Wenninger! James Shearer did everything right, but Wenninger slams the door shut. He exploded into the offense, and all he wanted to do at top speed was make sure he hit the target. He did right up the middle, and a stunning save from Wenninger. Well, that'll make the highlight reel. There's your save of the week. That's phenomenal. Earhart drops it off for Phillips. He's going to throw one to the net. Cozen has to make a save. Oh, and he does the splits to keep it out. Has he? He has. It's under him somewhere. Well, these two goalies have really been trying to one-up each other this weekend. A wonderful stop from Wenninger and a big one from Cozen. Let's take a see if we can see it again. We'll just see the tail end. Yeah, 17 stops on the night for Wenninger so far. 17 face-offs apiece, 19 shots for the Storm, so have a couple of shot advantage on the Blaze, but such a close game again. Really, really similar to last night. Oh, the Storm might be able to break here on a three on two. With a turnover in the neutral zone, Martin on the backhand, throws it in front. They hit the post. Cozen thinks he's kept it out, the light's gone on. Johnson celebrating. We'll have a look at this again as the Manchester Storm might have just doubled their lead. I think this will get reviewed. Yeah, puck comes there, comes across. Coral comes forward. Cozen's wrapped round. Difficult one for the referees to take a look at there. You just can't tell, can you? I mean, there's the, there's the hit off the pipe that's pretty obvious. And then, you know, your natural physics, that's going to bounce off Cozen and behind him somewhere. It's just whether he's able to stop it before the goal line. And they've caught it a goal. Manchester looking to bring this up ice. Here's Phillips. Gets it between the legs of Blake Thompson. Flicked into the neutral zone and ahead of Aiden Spellacy. Spellacy will try and get round Morrow with the puck. Morrow stands his ground. Spellacy still in the fight though. Is it's going to come away for him via Dudek. Spellacy looks out in front. Dudek with a big chance. Big save. Wenninger. Thompson tries to, excuse me, Thompson tries to hack it towards there. Hopkins was also trying to pull it free. That is, is uh, Thompson heading up ice. He gets the offensive zone. Still carrying it, Blake Thompson. Looking for an individual opportunity, but he ends up blowing a tire, and Murphy will take that one easily and start the Manchester still up ice. Nice little drop off for Coral. Coral on the backhand towards the net. It's under the pad of Cozen. He sits on it. And there'll be a little bit of pushing and shoving with uh, Zach Phillips and a uh, member of the Blaze defensive core. Yeah, a little bit of uh, discussion there after the uh, after the play. Get another look here on the replay. Storm coming down the left wing. Coral flicks it up and tries to go across there. But puck is loose there. And a little bit of a shove after the whistle there uh, from the Coventry Blaze on Zach Phillips. Blaze do have time for one more nip uh, up ice into the offensive zone. But have to be quick about it. Luciani, drop off for Talberg. 10 seconds in the period. Shearer, zips it across, top of the circle. Shot to the goal line, big chance out in front. Luciani trying to play it between his legs, I think. That would have been a highlight real goal if he'd have been able to score it, but the Manchester Storm collapse around the goalie. They prevent the shot on target, and they take a two goal lead going into the third. There is the tall number 10. Shot through the crease, will come out the other side. The Blaze will chop it into the neutral zone, picked up by Luciani. It might be a 2 one with Spellacy. Luciani looking for Spellacy, pass comes off Earhart. Blaze will change the uh, defensive pair on this uh, PK, halfway through the power play. Morrow waiting for it, grabs it. Dumps it in, good tip in front by Farley, and a good save by Cozen. Morrow read that beautifully. But so did the Blaze net, Mindry shuts the door. 
pass to the point. Shot through a crowd, gets heavily redirected on the way through. Kukali shovels it round the boards. Stick saved by Kozen. And Garcia goes to pick it up in the neutral zone. Storm throw it in again deep. Thompson first to it, gets enough to find Kukali up the middle. Talberg. The streaking Luciani, he's got Curran heading to the net. Luciani for Curran, it was in the air, he just couldn't get a redirection on it. Nice idea between the two speedsters on this line. Norrish is definitely trying to do a lot himself here and carry the team offensively and defensively. These are their top point scoring defenseman. Dudek in the corner, looking for a, a way out of Critchlow's clutches. Big battle in front of net with Garcia and Spellacy. Norrish. Dudek to the back door. It comes up. A body out in front. Cook has the net. Good save by Weninger. Shearer went for a rebound. Garcia's got all upset with Spellacy on this shift. He's now going to have a little cuddle with uh, Shearer. Well, there's a big tussle in front of the net. CJ Garcia's helmet comes off. And the, the referee seemed to just let him. You know, we'll get. We'll, don't take another look there, but they get right up in tangle there. It just seems a little bit of a bizarre sequence again. Storm's trying to keep the blaze to the perimeter, but they're going to break out here. Norrish drops it off. Cross for Christo. Back for Curran. One time a set up for Norrish. He breaks his stick, but it comes off the backboard and they score! Kobe Roth with a final touch. The Broken stick really messed a little bit of the uh, concentration up for the penalty kill. He came off the backboards, Alpha Roth. He dunks it, the big celebration for his 24th of the year, Stu. Uh, fantastic from the Blaze on the five on three opportunity. Christo then back, big one to Norwich. Their puck comes off the board there. Kobe Rural, very quick hands, very quick there. Gets the puck, gets it back in, and uh, I think it, more critically for the Coventry Blaze, they managed to get that in on the 5-on-3, so we'll still be 5-on-4 here. Ian McNaughty worried a little bit about too many men on the ice. We'll do a quick bit of mental arithmetic and then jump on the puck. He's picked, oh, he's picked away by Tremblay. Tremblay on the backhand, good save by Cozen. Now the Blaze are going to have to hustle up ice. Into the final two minutes, Christo. The Blaze gas tank is, I've got to say, looking a, a little waning here. Here's Tom Norris. He shoots. Tipped out in front of the bar from McNulty, I think. Maybe Roth, either way. Have we got time to see it again? Agonizingly close to the Blaze, too. And to get a, another look at this opportunity for the Coventry Blaze, Johnny Curran has that puck. Just turns, gets himself facing towards the net, and then one in uh, from the deep there, and like I said, just off the bar there, and the Blaze oh, now please. take their time out. Yeah. Roth holds it up at the half wall. And the Blaze will go to work. Here's Christo. Scored last night. Has he got another one in him here? He's got it at the perimeter. Norrish, we thought about the shot through the crowd. The shoot tipped in front. There's a big rebound out in front. Wendinger made a spectacular save on that sequence. On the tip, moving the laterally. I don't know whether we'll see it again. Can we try? Because this was a terrific save. Yeah, it's. Uh, I think you, you've got Blake Thompson uh, on the left-hand side of defence. JD Dudek's playing the right. It's five forwards and one D on. Yeah, Jack Hopkins getting the last shift as well. He'll play that in behind the net. Blaze need it out in open ice quickly, which they're not going to get. And the Manchester Storm win the back-to-back -back in the tail end of the season. Big, big two points for them and a big result the other way for the Coventry Blaze too.